Hi, good afternoon everyone. Um, this afternoon I'm going to show you how to cross pollinate hibiscus or the gomamella. So the first thing to do is we have to identify first the female and the male um, pollens or something like that. So okay, yeah. Um, yeah. what I'm going to show you is this uh, petals here. Very red um, and then there's a pinkish something inside of gomamella. So we have here the female. If you can see the, this the female here this big um, round shape the red one and the male is this yellow thing here so female and the male with gomamella and hibiscus it's very seldom that they do self-pollination because there's there's a gap between the male and the female so gardeners or breeders they tend to cross pollinate this gomamella so i'm going to show you how to cross pollinate very easy way in a very easy way so i have here a plant here so I actually, um, uh, this one here, okay. Um, okay, I'm going to do the pink one. So we have to cover the female, which is the female heel with the male pollens. So like this, until we have to make, it sh make sure that the female is all covered with the male, um, something like germs, how do you call it? Germs, something like that. So that's it. We are, yeah, and then we also cover the the male with a female, female flower, something like this. So okay, when it's all covered, you can just see because it's all covered now with, with the pollens. Like look at that one. So, in due time, in two weeks, we will be creating a new variety of gumamella or the hibiscus so when it um in two weeks this one this bud here where the petals grow it will automatically close um because it starts to create the it starts to mature and then the, the seeds will gonna form inside this green sepals so it will be like this once it's close if you can see it will be like this and then what's inside would be the the seeds forming already and when it matures you have to be very careful because in two weeks it's gonna pop out so be careful and you have to watch watch this ones here and then once mature then you can just replant um, these seeds so yeah. that's it thank you so much guys for watching that's how quick and easy to yeah. pollinate hibiscus and create a new flower so bye